Most micrographic surgery is typically performed under local anesthetic. This usually happens in an office-based surgical setting or alternatively in a minor surgical suite in a hospital, depending which country you are or what province you're having your surgery done in. Occasionally, the use of oral sedation is also used to help patients to relax during the procedure. When the surgeon meets the patient, a marking die is, or a marker is used to place a, a mark around the visible tumor that they can see. The area is anesthetized with local anesthesia. Once the patient's comfortable and the area is frozen, a very narrow one millimeter to two millimeter edge is taken around the visible tumor that we can see. That area is then shelled out um, and it's taken to a separate table, a counter, where the tissue is divided, dyed, and submitted into the lab, which is part of the facility. The surgeon then communicates with the histotechnologist, describing the areas that are critical for visualization, and the histotechnologist uses specialized techniques to allow relaxation of the tissue and complete visualization of the entire tissue margin. This tissue is then dyed, and histologic slides are prepared and analyzed. Those slides allow the surgeon to then go back and identify specific tumor focuses. Because the surgeon, on the removal of the tissue, makes minor marks or slight nick incisions on the edge of the wound, localizing exactly where the pieces came from on the patient is easy to do. Maps are made before the specimens are submitted to the histotechnologist, so any interpreted tumor that's identified in the slides can be precisely mapped from the exact location it came from the patient. At that point in time, if residual tumor exists, the surgeon will bring the patient back into the room, ensure that the anesthesia is stable or add additional anesthetic, and take additional tumor or sections of tissue in a systematic way only where the cancer remains. By this way, over the course of many stages, the cancer can be completely eradicated.